In these challenging and unprecedented times, the education system has relied on technology to keep up with its students' needs. But even when those classrooms open, online learning will prevail as one of the main pillars for schools across Canada to provide world-class education while utilizing the latest technology across as many devices as possible. George Brown College currently offers most of its programs via online, as well as other essential services that are required to fulfill its community's needs. So, what's it like to actually use these digital services? Several systems and applications required to handle academic life, where the user must log into each of them individually, the experience becomes repetitive and frustrating. For this reason, the GBC app is perceived as impractical and is left unused. This is a problem since the user becomes constrained to the use of personal computers and laptops to take full advantage of GBC offering educational. In a post-COVID environment, the college must provide IT solutions for the community, regardless of the device they are using. The community currently must access these individual services. StuView, which is the system to register classes, record grades, and payments of tuition fees. The GBC email, the official way of communication, communication among community members and Blackboard, which is the virtual learning environment where professors and students interact. The project consists of implementing an application programming interface, or API, to integrate the GBC app with these digital services. As you can see in the diagram, an API is a software intermediary that allows two or more applications to interact with each other from a single point. Therefore, the new application would operate as if StuView, the GBC Mail, and Blackboard were built in the GBC app. To identify the specific problem to address, Team Cherry conducted a survey that was shared via Google Forms exploring user interface and satisfaction, as well as identify users' preference on improving integration. Let's see the main results. The first question allows us to identify overall satisfaction levels. The responses show high dissatisfaction and indifference towards the app. This indicates a very low level of use and more than even 20% of people, which include students and professors, have never even used it. These responses highlight an area of opportunity in terms of usability and user-friendly value and interface. Mostly everyone would appreciate the value of the GBC app slash Blackboard integration. We received mixed opinions on concerns about user interface and utilities, so we would consider both are valuable to make improvements. We can conclude that the GBC app we currently have is not as beneficial and useful as it aims to be. Our main stakeholders are the users, who are the students and the professors, that are using it very little or even sometimes not even using it at all. While the client and sponsor of the project have the objective of increase and expand new ways to teach and learn as per the college's business plan. Therefore, it is crucial to offer value to the college community. The expectation is to have the new GBC app ready to deploy for the semester of fall 2021. So Team Cherry developed the following plan to allocate the five working packages, which are planning, designing, coding, testing, and app delivery. The work breakdown structure has a bottom-up approach, so we define the specific task with their associated cost and time of completion. The total duration of the project is 95 days, with a total cost of $44,420. This includes the cost of labor, rent of development equipment, computers, and a server to allocate the application at the college. Therefore, the milestones to monitor for the project are the technical requirement report, the demo of the app running in both operating systems, 
the source code of the app being delivered, the testing report of no outstanding issues, and finally, the notification of the app being uploaded to the marketplaces, so it will be ready for the users. As you can see here, our main focus is on the coding and testing phases, where most of the budget and project duration are allocated. The reason for this is that Team Cherry strongly believes that we must ensure the quality of the final product. An important consideration is risk management. Therefore, Team Cherry defined a list of 10 risks of how they could be managed. The main three are overcrowding and app misconfiguration of the app, resulting in bugs, glitches, and system crashes. This issue may re even result in cancellation of tests and exams. Their probability is high and they have a high impact. This approach would be mitigating the risk with a testing on its capacity and stability before the launch and the IT team being ready to detect the issue and fix it as soon as possible. Finally, the system being hacked by third parties. Compromising the data and the code, this risk is low in probability but high on its impact. To mitigate it, the development of security elements will be part of the coding phase. Additionally, the IT team will be ready to intervene. For the payback period, we consider that this improvement to the GBC app will lead to students to be more interested in continuing education because a seamless experience will make students return to expand their skills. Considering the average cost of $350 per course, we foresee a conservative increase of 0.3% on enrolled students, taking into account that 64,531 students enrolled at George Brown's College continuing education in the year of 2020. We can expect to see an estimated return of $67,757 for the following academic year, paying the project in less than eight months. I hope this works. This is so much better. Beyond the financial benefits of the redesign, this project will help alleviate the pressures and stresses the college community is currently facing, making their digital academic journey a seamless experience, where the focus is on acquiring knowledge and developing skills. When George Brown invests in this project, they will be able to stand out from the competition, leading the way to the academic future. Team Cherry will be happy to address any further questions that you may have. Thank you for watching.